In this video I'm going to discuss about Shampoo Snap 10 which is a brand new program. Um, I know I did about a Shampoo Snap 9 not so long back but uh, Snap 10's just come out which is uh, amazing really. Uh, it, it's a, I think it's a fantastic program. Doing these videos is always very very difficult because what you're doing is you're having this having two screenshot programs up at the same time and you get so mixed up with it um so if i get mixed up in the video that's that's where it is anyway so what you have if people are first coming to this and when they first load the program up um they will find uh like script like um screenshot things where they tell you what to do they actually do my head in them but they there for a reason for people who, who don't know the program and they just like hints okay so anyway and in in, when you actually see the program it's on the top right um this here on the right hand side is oops just go back to that is configure this is where all your settings are um and what you do in your outputs um you can have things like uh PNG is the default, which it, it usually goes to. I and mean, I'm just going to discuss just firstly about the um, the screenshot program itself first. And then the edits, this is where you would edit things that you've perhaps done before. Um, you know, so anyway. Then this bit here, it's uh, capture text. Um, you can time your captures. And you can also capture multiple window objects and you can have them as it shows uh, there how you prefer um the color picker what that does a cut it's just a normal color picker and uh, for example you could pick a color here and then that will go to the clipboard and then you could paste it so for example if you're doing graphic design or from a picture or uh, web design you could do that um, capture menu that's just basically capturing uh, a particular menu capture fixed re fixed region um, which is you know this is uh, your 640 800 by 600 a lot of your some full screen sizes here of your um, desktop laptop or whatever <clears throat> Or even um, photographs and that, and uh, some of them will be uh, photographic size. Here is capture freestyle region. They them there personally, I don't, I wouldn't particularly use them. I never have. I've been using uh, snaps since five or six, I think. Anyway, this this is an interesting one, which is a freestyle thing. So, for example, I've got uh, just a game of cricket here. This is Durham against. Uh, someone can't remember who anyway but this is just you know you're going over so it's um it's actually yeah, i'll show you what it does okay and this can be quite useful for if you if you just want to pick out a particular you know for example if it's a face um whether it's an animal or whatever anyway so that would be that is something i use um okay so of course it's got save do not save cancel and the next one is capture free rectangle region and this is the one i use probably the most in the uh, screenshot program itself anyway so on the i go from uh, top left to right on the uh, on the top there you've got open help uh, which just uh, help topics you've got rename capture so you can rename that whatever you want i think this is a new uh this is new from even the shampoo nine snap nine um you can absolutely uh, resize the capture canvas you can resize capture and you can change the background color flatten la uh, layers you can apply effects and this is absolutely so cool which is it's like a graphic package all in one okay so you can of all sorts you can have black and white you can have pixelated wood embossed um you can have all sorts of sepia you know like an old uh old style if you look at that it looks like an old picture um you can apply date time to website or whatever um you know so you can do that um you can have 
apply mouse you can put your watermark on there so wherever your watermark is you can have watermark with text and then that, you could do that as well um, I'm just briefly going over this I want to go in more detail at a later date because I've only had this probably about five days I think um, you can apply fade to an image um, you can apply it to the left top top right uh, as you see there that's that's done that on the on the picture on the image you can go to the left and it does the same there or you can just have none um, it's it's you can do so much with this program it's absolutely fantastic this this um, compared to, to nine I think it's smoother I think it's uh, better and uh, you know it really I think it's a, a cut above that even uh, even just within that uh, nine to ten and you can uh, you un rotate 90 degrees go right you can mirror so for example that's a mirror you can do that up and down um, and really you can zoom in zoom out this is your undo redo you can undo all and basically that's a great uh, scroll you can crop this you can pixelate blurred you can erase something so for example you wanted this chap here erasing and you can do that this would be more helpful i think if you like for example you've got um, a white background and you could do it that way um although with here is the color so you can you can basically i, I didn't know that i thought it was just white but um so you can basically do anything you want with that eraser um the blur pen you could blur just part of a picture out just by doing that um your marker pen you can just mark something if, for example if you wanted uh, if you were to send on uh, something over to uh, a client or your workmate or whatever and you just wanted uh, to to highlight a particular thing you could highlight this cricketer you can do this for text and everything like that you know that is uh, such a good feature and you can do this as well um, by doing the thing rectangular region there I've just done but you can do it in red that's highlight so your eye goes straight to that you can do that ready there's a flood fill thing and there's also a rectangle ellipse and you can just put in there um, you know and then you can also do your opacity on that as well so yeah you can, you can do absolutely everything this is the the king of uh of screenshot programs the pencil you know all sorts you can do with this you can do arrows so for example if you wanted something pointing out um you can do that or for example this this is the other way around because that's the way I've done it. I know this is looking a bit messy now, but that's actually says banks. So you could point an arrow there. Um, yeah, so it's uh, it's it's brilliant, really. Um, you know, are you going to do all? So you're back to that. Um, so I know it's not as confusing now. So you can put text in. You can put a hint. So for example, you could just start typing a hint. And you pull this down and you could say um you know anything you want really he's having a good game or you know if uh, it's you can put these on facebook on twitter on anything um it's it's awesome really um the stamp is quite good you can it's got social media it's got all these things here um arrows galore um and it's also got flags which is interesting as well uh emoticons all your flags so for example you know you've uh you wanted to put a flag in your um design so you just uh you know you can just put that up there and you can put up the opacity as well okay so it's uh yeah there's so much you can do with this thing you can put a spotlight on so put a spotlight on this player here okay and uh everything else will be slightly out of blur 
and a configure uh, uh, like you can when you you know when it's at the top right so what else you can do is on the right hand side on here as well is it's you can open a capture from this so you can actually um, you know get another capture from what's already been done you can keep the capture and uh, you can send it to another app you can print it you can put it at the clipboard you can put it to photoshop and what I usually do is export capture to another location. You can also now, and I think this is also new, you can actually send your image uh, or whatever to Twitter or Facebook. So, for example, you wanted to do that. Um, this goes to a Shampoo web, uh, their, their server, and then, you know, you can do whatever you, you want with that. So, yeah, so this is... Uh, this is really really good um upload capture to a shampoo web space you can go to a capture in the cloud and that goes to dropbox um you can go and send this by webmail and you can send the capture by email delete capture and save capture which goes to that by default a shampoo's uh, folder okay so that's basically um, as I say, I'll try and go in depth a bit more when I've uh, really had much more play around with this thing. Okay, so the best part for me is is that you can have, um, I mean, this would appeal to gamers, uh, to people who use uh, webcams and things like that, because it's got all sorts of things. And this is the video capture. Here it has... Um, the single window uh, desktop uh, primary monitor a rectangular region which is what i use so you can do anything you want or you can have fixed regions you can have a webcam as well but anyway so i'll just start off by having this here so you've got uh, okay you just click that okay start capture and you minimize the capture and you can just play this okay so this is uh this is Urzel, who i think is a genius um you know so what you would do with that is you just stop that okay and uh you could um just stop this with capture key and when it says the video recording function is still active and what do you want to do yes okay so this would now go to this, which is brand new. Um, you can hear me on there, so I'll just stop that. Okay. So before with a shampoo snap, you couldn't um, you couldn't cut it. Okay. So you would have to send it. Really, you can't. You could have sent it up, you know, to YouTube or whatever you wanted to do with it. But now you can actually do edits in this program. So this really is. To me, this is this is a game changer, and I've used this on the last three videos. And in one video, I, I really messed it up, and I had to cut it into three parts. And those three parts were seamlessly. I don't think anybody would be able to take, would be able to see where it started, where it ended, and that type of thing. And this is quite easy to to do. You just find two, um, you know, two cut points, and you just you just cut them, and that's all you do. So there's the blue line or the blue patch what you what you cut out and that um and now when I'm doing like say tutorial videos uh for coding and bootstrap studio and all the rest of it um now I can do everything in there I don't have to go to a third party um uh, usually I use Wondershare or something like that but I don't have to do that now I just have to just cut it in, in a shampoo snap 10 and that does all the work for us really and this is uh and it's also got <coughs> it's also got a, a gif animator if you want to just cut a little part out um and you can know where it says a penned video file that's just um you can add and take away you can have loads of videos all together to, to make one like i did the other day and this uh this is I'm very excited about this because I think this is going to work well. So anyway, um, 
that's about it in a nutshell for now i know i've gone what is it 15 minutes so thanks uh, thanks for watching